What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Sneaky Sneaks back with another video. All right, today I'm going to do a review on the Air Jordan 14 Black Toes. I just got these in today. And here's a look at the box. Size nine and a half. And the official colorway is white, varsity red, black. Air Jordan 14 Retro. All right, I'm going to give you guys a quick look. Check them out. Man, these are clean. Wow. These are dope right here. I just got these in today. Very happy with this pickup. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the other shoe real quick. All right. All right, there it is. The Air Jordan 14 Black Toes. These are really dope, man. Uh, I got these off the Nike app and they sold out really fast, man. I can't believe how fast these sold out, but uh, I'm just glad to have my pair. And these are one of my favorite OG 14 colorways. These and the last shots uh, are my favorite, but I think I kind of like these a little bit better than the last shots. But this is just a clean shoe, man. I love the color blocking. This is a nice shoe. I think these last released uh, back in 2014. And I think the first retro was in 2006. And the, uh, the first retro had like the little, the little ridges on the side. I didn't like that. Um, I like this better with the little smooth surface right here. I like that smoother look right there better than the uh, the ridges. But this is just a clean shoe, man. Clean colorway. Very nice. All right, the Air Jordan 14s. Uh, this was the first colorway to release. Uh, back in 98, back in 1998, this was the first OG colorway to release. And the white and red ones was the second colorway to release. The last shots um, released back in 99, the spring of 99. And it was actually the first colorway that MJ rocked on the court, uh, the last shots. And uh, he won in the NBA Finals and took his last shot with the Chicago Bulls and won his sixth NBA championship. But uh, although he wore, the, he wore those first, this was the first uh, colorway to release. And, you know, it's a really classic colorway. Just an iconic silhouette. Uh, Michael Jordan did rock these in a documentary called Michael Jordan to the Max. Uh, he wore these, it was in the introduction, when he uh, jumped from the free throw line at the United Center, and he was rocking these bad boys right here. But these are just dope, man. Um, clean, clean colorway. I just, I just love the color blocking on this shoe. You got your uh, Jordan and red going across the top of the tongue right there, and... This shoe is actually the des uh, design after the Ferrari, uh, Michael Jordan's favorite sports car, the Ferrari. Um, as you can see, it has that shape. You got the uh, Ferrari symbol right there with the jump man on the inside. And on the back, you got that red, that red going across. You got the jump man in gray, and you got a 23 in gray. And as you can see right here, you have the, the black rubber right here. 
which is the uh, the tire traction. That that reminds me of a tire right there, like the traction on a tire, and you got the the tail lights right here in red. Really dope concept. And on the medial side, you got your white upper, nice tumble upper, and you got your your midsole with that silver. You got that little vent in the corner there. The leather on these is really nice. Nice, decent leather on these. The midsole has some kind of like glitter effect. You got a little bit of glitter on the midsole. And this is like a like a pearl white. I know some of the um the other retros in this shoe, the midsole had had an off-white look. You know, it had a little off-white look to it, but this is like a, a pure white. Um, but you got your black bottom. You got your silver there with your red jump man. You got that red dot with the uh, 14 Roman numeral. You got your traction on the bottom. Really nice shoe. On the inside, you got a white jump man. And there are seven jump mans on each shoe which uh, equals to 14. Uh, if you have a pair, you can see that there's uh, seven on each shoe. There's one here. You got one on the inside. That's two, three, four, five. Let me see if I can find I don't know, but hey, it's seven jump mans on each shoe, okay? All right, uh, you got that new buck in the toe box right here. Some nice, nice new buck, nice suede with that red jump man. You got the tongue, even the tongue is uh suede. And going up, you got that mesh at the top with your black laces. But these are just clean. Uh, one of my favorite Air Jordan 14s. Um, just a really nice shoe. But yeah, man, these are nice. I remember when they first dropped back in 98. And uh, they were in a Slam magazine. I don't know if you guys ever heard of Slam magazine. But that's where uh, everybody used to find out about the latest drops and, and when they release um, through the Slam magazine. And that was how, you know, we knew when sneakers dropped. And I, I used to collect a lot of them back in the day. And I can remember when this one, uh, when this Slam magazine dropped, it had the, the Black Toe 14s and it had the, uh, the Last Shot 14s. And they had this big poster inside of the magazine uh with the black toe and the uh the last shot and i can just re remember that man and it, it was just cool to see that you know back in the day it was just it just had a lot of a lot of releases back in the day man you had a lot a lot of shoes that that dropped back in the 90s and uh Back then, we didn't have, you know, all these apps and stuff that we can order online. You know, we really, the way we found out about sneaker releases was through the Slam Magazine or East Bay. That's that's pretty much it. I don't even think they had 23 years back, uh, back in the day. But uh, just a dope shoe. Um, this, this color blocking is really nice. I like the, uh, the OG colorways especially the white and black. I can remember back in the 90s, uh, from 95 to 97, uh, Michael Jordan would debut the new Jordans and his first colorway would be in white and black. And I, I just I just like um, the color contrast with this silhouette. Just a cool look, man. Really dope sneakers. 
You guys leave a comment below and tell me what's your favorite 14 colorway. Um, I would have to go with these, man. Uh, Black Toes is my favorite. And right after that is the, the last shots. And, um, and the white and reds. Those are my top three. But very happy with this pickup. I would have to say this is one of my, my favorite pickups of the year. Um, these will definitely be in my top 10, top five this year. But really happy to have these. I'm going to go ahead and throw these on feet for you guys. So stay tuned. Alright, that was my review and on foot of the Air Jordan 14 Black Toes. You guys feel free to leave a comment below and tell me what you think of these. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed the content. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And stay tuned for more videos. We got more videos on the way. Until next time, y'all be blessed. Peace.